Hello, my name is Jim Burkhard with uh, IHS and I'm here at Sarah Week 2013. It's uh, Tuesday, March 5th and I'm here to uh, provide some comments on the day's uh, sessions. The big theme that we saw in just about every session uh, here today had to do with the role of unconventional oil and gas in North America talking about how that big growth story is impacting not just the upstream industry, but the downstream industry as well. And a related theme, a related big question, is how quickly and to what degree will unconventional oil and gas spread elsewhere around the world. There are early signs, there's some activity in other places with regard to shale gas. For example, in our downstream session, uh, we heard about some initial drilling activity in Poland, which has uh, prospects for unlocking some of its uh, unconventional oil and gas reserves. Much of this excitement and interest is derived from what's happened in North America, this great revival of U.S. oil and gas production. If we were to go back to Sierra Week 2010, we heard a lot about gas. That was a big theme. Now oil is increasingly a major part of this unconventional story. And when, you, and when you look at what's happened in the U.S., it is stunning. Last year, for example, and this was mentioned several times, last year, U.S. oil production grew by about 910,000 barrels per day. How big is that? It's very big. Total world oil demand growth last year was 650,000 barrels per day. So the U.S. alone saw its oil production rise faster than the pace of total world oil demand growth. It's big. And this has only happened a few times in, in the history of the oil industry. Saudi Arabia for a couple of years in the 1970s, Iraq in 1979. Those are really the only times we've seen a country increase its production in a single year as much as we saw in the United States in 2012. And that's likely to uh, continue. So this unconventional oil and gas theme, the upstream story, the downstream story, and also the economic impact. This is not just about producing more supply, it's also about the, the jobs that are created uh, throughout the value chain upstream and downstream. So it's a very big story and we'll probably hear more, of, more about the unconventional oil and gas uh, developments uh, through the rest of this week.